Assalamu alaikum and welcome to another episode of M Plus Bites. Today we're at Fatima's Grill in Downey, California. And um, they are a fusion place, so they have Lebanese food, so you'll have like shawarma, wraps, and things of that nature. But you'll also have burritos and Philly cheesesteak. Um, let's check this place out since it's allowed. What's interesting about uh, Ali, the owner, is the, the restaurant's actually named after his daughter, Fatma. And uh, he actually had a meat market, which he started about four years ago. And about two years in, he realized there's a lot of demand for the food. Um, so he uh, opened a restaurant instead and closed down the meat market. And there's been a lot of um, demand for his work. So I came in here, there's actually space to sit in, but there's still a one hour wait for the food to come out. So there's so much like to go orders that are going in that they actually have a backlog of items. So now we come to the piece de resistance. This is the carne asada price. Um, people have been bugging us to try this place just for this dish. Um, the last time I had carne asada was a, a vegan one. Uh, I'd seen a vegan tacos if you guys remember that episode. So. Actually they have waffle fries and, and normal fries too with uh, the meat. So carne asada, uh, one of my producers tells me it's basically flank steak that's been cut out. And um, it's actually pretty good. Yeah. I personally am not a big fan of fries, but this, this is good. It's, it's like loaded fries, we ever had loaded fries. It's kind of like that, but with chunkier pieces of uh, meat. I'm actually not sure what um, sauces they put on top, so if you see in the video, um, he puts like these jalapenos and he puts like these small green peppers and it puts like tomatoes and there's some green sauce and some white sauce that he puts in. I have no idea what they are. I have a feeling if you like fries, you like this. Even if you don't like fries, you like the meat anyway. I'm gonna try it with the sauce. Oh yeah, you want the sauce. This has a kick to it. It's it's spicy. It's chipotle something. I take it back. I don't care if you like fries or not. Get this. Put the sauce on top. Worth it. I haven't said that yet, so I'll say it. Today I ordered a, a bunch of different items. I got the uh, the tongue taco. Uh, lingua, I think is, is what it's called. So it's got cilantro, uh, you got chunks of tongue, and you've got the onions, and you got lemons on the side. So. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of the... <laughs> squeeze a little bit of the lemon on top. Oh, this is a this is a chunky taco. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff in here. Let me try to see if I can get this in. That's good. Like it's not spicy or anything. There's um, avocado. It's not the pico de gallo like I thought. This is so flavorful. I didn't think I liked dung. It's got this nice, like seared um, top layer, and then you have this this delicate, like almost fatty uh, meat, which which. Once you chew in a few times, it pretty much melts in your mouth. It's absolutely delicious. So if you've never had uh, lingua, which is tongue taco, I definitely try it. And this is halal. You, you don't really get a chance to try this as much. So now we have the Macho Man burrito. This thing is humongous, but finding in Los Angeles, the burritos are all big. <laughs> so this one has uh, beef, chicken, it has pico de gallo, sour cream, and hot Cheetos. So 
I'm excited. Um, anything hot Cheetos? Oh shit. Look at that monster. Hey. Let's see, I don't know if you can see the, the hot Cheetos there. Let me try and zoom in for you guys. So these flecks that you see, that's the hot Cheetos right there. Right. You know what, I'm gonna try plain, then I'm gonna put the sauce on. Oh damn. The rice you're using. The rice you're using is like biryani rice. It's not the. Like this is not normal rice that you expect in a burrito. This is yellow grains of rice uh, on it. And um, it's almost like saffron rice. It's, it's crazy. I wasn't expecting this. This is good. Yeah, we're tired with the sauce now. Honestly, the, the basmati rice or whatever they're using, it adds such a such an interesting like kick of flavor. You're not expecting that kick, and um, the sauce doesn't really make much of a difference. Honestly, it's so good by itself. It's totally fine. I'm loving this. I, I love the fact that a fusion uh, burrito place didn't mess up the burrito. That makes me happy. What's also interesting is the chicken. It's like the chicken shawarma chicken. It's not like normal chicken. And I have a feeling the beef, the beef is basically like beef shawarma. Oh yeah. I'm, I'm glad I ordered this. I'm glad I actually waited. So if I were to pick one dish that I absolutely had to get here, it would be the, the tongue taco. But my friends absolutely love the carne asada fries, um, especially with the sauce on top. And I think that's, that's pretty good too. But for me, the burrito, especially with that, um, that rice, uh, I wasn't expecting it. For me, it was a completely pleasant surprise having like the, the flavored rice that you're expecting with like a kebab plate or something in a burrito. That just blew my mind. I was like, yeah, worth it. Um, Fatima's Grill in Downey. Um, good service, even though it was extremely crowded. The owner has been really helpful and really nice. He let me film in the kitchen and everything. I'd highly recommend you try it out. But yeah, that concludes uh, another episode of M Plus Bites. I um, hope you get a chance to try Fatima's Grill. So. Mohammed, thank you again for coming. I appreciate it. It was great having you, and I'll see you soon. Thank you. Okay, start your back, start your back.